Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. I'm Peter Drury, and here with me in the commentary box, I'm glad to report, is Jim Beglin. Well, thank you very much, Mr Drury, and hello to everyone. Things running. Omar El Abdullawi. So what now? Oh, the ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Good clearance and very necessary. Could have been in. Just needed a better final ball. I thought it was good vision, but the execution was poor. Plays it out to the flank. Portia. Now the pass. Straight offside. Midway through the first half, and there's an impotence about this game that's causing me concern, and, and probably most of the stadium too. Let's just hope that by the end, it'll have been forgotten. He's come flying in. Looks like a good ball through. He's tried one. Oh, nearly. But nearly is nothing. Well, if he hopes to do better than that, he's got to work on his technique and his timing. The contact wasn't right there, so there wasn't much chance of success. He's given a throw. It's a good throw at all, really. He's given away possession cheaply. Looks to slip it through. Is it out wide now? Aimed long and direct. That's offside. Yes, it is. Pulled back for that one. Well, oh, that's a booking, always looked it. Well, the protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. <laughs> a 
He's had a crack. Oh, good stop, it had to be. All this over the line. Omar El Abdullawi. Masuaku. Confirmation that there will be two minutes stoppage time. Oh, good interception. We hit half time. So they head in no further forward. The score here still nil nil. Start of another 45 minutes. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. That tackle, ball won cleanly. Come back to the keeper. Done very well to intervene. Crunching tackle. Tries a through ball. That's another to add to football's endless list of could haves and should haves. Well, he needed to be much more precise, but that was very short on quality into the middle. Now the pass. Danger averted for now. And the through ball is intercepted. He's not played the ball, that's a foul. And it's Masuaku. Out to the flank. Pin into the middle. He's there to get rid. Looks to slip it through. And he's through on goal. Really well taken goal. All goals are welcome, but when they come at a time like that, they're priceless. Oh my goodness, that has ripped the rigging. Is it just me or did he make that look very, very easy? That was terrific skill and composure from him. He finished with such a plum. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, and they still have enough time to carve out a chance or two and get right back into this. So they've got the only goal to give them a 1-0 lead. Hurtles into the tackle. Now it's Brown a day. Brown it A. Brown it A with a shot. Superb from Brown it A. Two up and threatening to pull clear. He was urged to shoot and he duly delivered. Well, he's got the result there, but you really have to question that defence or lack of it.
activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Olympiakos have a couple of goals without reply. It's 2 0. Fine defending there. Good idea, just poorly executed. Down it day. Here, the collective sigh there, they know they got away with one. Oh, well intercepted, really alerts the danger. Can he find a finish now? Oh, that's been repelled. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Plays it out to the wing. There are a few waiting for it. There goes the final whistle. So they bask in their win, a genuinely professional performance and a result which is well-deserved. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Oh, listen, if you've got that kind of power and, and that kind of pace in your team, I think you'll plough through most teams. Those central areas tend to be very congested, lots of traffic going on, but it wasn't a problem for them. Well, thanks for your company, Jim, and a very good day to you.